Just look at the camera and say, Welcome to Alton Towers. Welcome to Alton Towers. And say, What do you else do you say? Say, Subscribe for more puppy videos. Subscribe for more puppy videos. Hello and welcome to another Creeper Families vlog. Today we are here at Alton Towers. We're here for two days, this is the first day we're staying in the CBeebies Hotel in the Mr Tumble Suite. Um, the weather's supposed to be pretty rubbish today, so this afternoon we're going to Splash Landings Water Park. I've been here loads of time, so I came to uni in Stafford, so we've had a little detour looking at my old uni. But it's so excited, isn't it Pops? Where are we going now? Where? CBeebies Land. Yeah. Oh wow, look at all that. She is living the dream. I win it. Is that the police academy music? It is, isn't it? Random. It's the police academy music. <laughs> she goes to see Movies Land. So if you were coming normally, that'd be the main entrance. But as the monorail was so busy, the um, the front gate would have been rammed and created a proper bottleneck there. So yeah, so we probably did the right thing. It's been a bit of a walk, but we were, we've got here quicker. At least we've warmed up. Should I be a few feet away from it? Don't look at these places. Don't look at it. This is not how we wanted to be up there. Don't walk over here! Don't walk away! Look away, so we have deflated! I did the deflated! Pubs, look! Hi, you're right. Wow, 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 wow! Do you like today? Oh, it's just like Biggleton, isn't it? Oh my goodness, right, let's go. So what have we got? So we've got Bing, Hey Dougie, then we've got Bing, and the Teletubbies live show. Pops, look who it is. Bingo, let's go meet him. Driving it up. Sitting down safely. Make sure you stay like that. I've loaded up the parcels. When we need to deliver a parcel, press the button that matches it. Does the real horn work? Yeah. Wow. It's art class today. At the oh, oh, stop in sorting out the Greendale Mail. She's Look just at the camera. Say, welcome to Alton Towers. Welcome to Alton Towers. And say, what do you else do you say? Say, subscribe for more puppy videos. Subscribe for more puppy videos. Here we go. You coming in with Daddy? Justin's House is probably one of my favourite kids' shows. I absolutely love it. So I've just been filling the bag. And we're going to get to the top. Speed on him, look. Right. No, no. All right, ready? Ready? Oh! They get some serious power. Right, I'll put another one in. Ready? Now, Chris, one. Boom! Right, I'm aiming for him now. I'm aiming. Oh, all right. What do you think of that, Pops? It was so much fun. Yeah, it was really, it was really noisy. It's quite dark, which is weird. This way, darling. Mummy's over here. This way, darling. Yeah, it's quite dark. But um, those like pellets. I know you're shooting real balls. Oh, God, they get some power on them. 
But you can just see all the parents just like, yeah. But yeah, it was good fun. Oh, wow, look at this. Here we come. Yeah, do you want to give Peter Rabbit a cuddle? Aww. Oh, that's lovely. Was it so good? Oh, Whoa. my father. Was it fun? Up and up and up in the air. Yeah. Bobby, look, it's the Teletubbies. Yes! Go on then. Another pro tip, second pro tip of the day, if you're going to go see one of the live shows in this little CBeebies kind of area, sit right in the middle because at the end they'll invite you to take a picture with um, characters and if you sat in the middle they start the queue there so you're already at the front. Pro tip number two, that's a good one. I think Grandad. Oh look, Grandad tumbles sleeping. Him? Oh, you can hear him snoring. Listen. Wake up. No. Oh, he's still snoring. Lovely. Thanks very much. Yeah, you, it's alright. Put it down. Green. And what does green mean? No. Yeah. Yeah, it's a bit like Mr. Tumble's house, isn't it? You went in Justin's house early, didn't you? Wow, that's the Oktoberfest bit. They do food in there. Wow, we'll have to go there later. Oh, and marshmallows. Wow, yummy. Well, we'll see them in later. We're going to have a look. Can we have one? Would you like one? Yeah. Well, of course you can have one. Mm. Look, they have fruit. Fruit in there, yeah. A little pit stop in the CBB shop. Wow. You want to get a Bing thing? I think she wants the best of cobble cut up. During the first lockdown, we got like a, a journal. We made a journal for Poppy and we drew like maps and all the different characters and stuff. Oh, look. Babe, a gardening hat. 
and a gardening apron. Oh, wow. So Oktoberfest opened on Sunday, Sunday the 12th of September. And um, yeah, it's the first time I've been here. Normally this green, um, this bit of grass here is just kind of uh, picnic benches and stuff. But it's wicked. Just the toast and marshmallows, oh my goodness. Just the health and safety nightmare. There's the castle in the background. Where's my hand? There, castle. And that's where the ride, now Poppy is technically tall enough to go on hence. But to be honest, he would frighten the life out of her. So we definitely won't be. Anyway, so while we're on the sky ride, getting all the way to, over to um, Nemesis, which is where we're going to get the hotel exit. I just want to talk to you about how we got here to the Sun Savers tickets. So we're not sponsored by Sun Savers, um, but a couple of years ago, I'm driving to work, listening to radio, and I heard an advert, and it said, buy 10, get 10 codes from Sun, put them in the app, you get two free adult tickets now. I hear a lot about two for ones and that sort of thing, or 50% off, which I'll go free. But two free adult tickets, I remember I got to work and I googled it and I was like, okay, maybe terms and conditions make say like say, make sense. So we literally collected two copies of the sum. Kim did, I did, so Kim got two free tickets for today, I got two free tickets for yesterday, we just played copy. Now back in 2018 before lockdown, we went um, to using that with we Old Towers, Thought Park, Chessington, Legoland, Warwick Castle, <laughs> to Old Towers, to Old Towers, um, and Sea Life Centre. All for probably the cost is probably free. All probably the cost like 30 quid, 20 quid worth of sun papers, and maybe 600 pounds worth of tickets. So I totally, if you see it, definitely buy it. It's not a scam. It actually works. You just pick the dates. The thing I'd say to do is the dates do run out. So you want because you have to pre-book it. So you want to collect them as quickly as you can. So you want to start collecting them on the day. You can only collect one code per day. Um, so you could just go and get 10 copies of the sun, or however many, it might not be 10. But you literally want to go on day one and then you're finished. So you, the morning that you've got the, the full number of tickets, you just get on a book so you've got a full range of days. You can go weekends, uh, weekdays, term time. It was exactly the right length of time that the... Um, the this is where say, yeah. Off, yeah, 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 okay. yeah. So this is where it said it was closed earlier. Oh, so yes, yeah, so definitely uh, just want to take a little break just to say that. Um, probably, whoa! Um, <laughs> can you just see Kim's face? Um, that's definitely the way you want to do any of the Merlin attractions, because otherwise we probably wouldn't have got the Merlin Pass, but we didn't need to probably spend about 30 quid to get the three of us to order them. So anyway, doors are open. So we've just left the park. Um, it is about 10 past one. Um, I went on Nemesis. There was no queue at all. Literally just went straight on it. It was it was, amazing. It was, it was as good as I you remember. Back out within 10 minutes. Like, yeah. on and out. It took me longer, because I had to do my shoelaces up, it took me longer to do my shoelaces up than it did to actually queue. Um, but it was really good. And, to answer another question, fun fact number three, I wasn't planning on counting, <laughs> fun fact number three is, you can get these wristbands, so um, the ride stopped loading, stopped queuing at five, but Oktoberfest is open until six, so I think we'll have a little bit of a splash around in Splash Landings. She's literally on her like fifth through. Oh, now she's off. We won't be able to film in the water park. No. Um, but for obvious reasons. But um, yeah, we we'll look forward to see if we can get some shots the outside of it. And uh, yeah, when we cut back, we can tell you all about it. When we come out, we can't get in the water. Oh no, we're going this way. So, as you can tell from the wet hair, we've just come out of the Splash London. I really enjoyed it. Um, I've seen it loads of times, I've never done it before. Couldn't film in there, like, they were really hot on that for obvious reasons. But it was really, really, really good. So they had a really good mixture of like, like one of the slides was pretty intense. What's that, darling? We're going back. We're going back to the hotel. Mr. Tumble's room. Um, yeah, really, really good. So they had a really good mixture of rides, um, like fast rides and then rides that I could go on with Poppy, which was really, really nice. They had like a lazy river inside. They had like um, 
like a hot tub stuff outside and they had this bit where you, you started inside and then you kind of slid and you landed in this pool outside and then you have like a choice of which one you want to go in and you slide down another level you've got another choice which slide you go in really really cool um like really nicely themed really clean really tidy lots of places to sit lots of places to eat they're the dedicated toddler bit it's really 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 good it was 47 pound 50 for the three of us um and we were in there for maybe an hour and 45. Yeah, you, I mean, you could spend a lot more time in there. Yeah. But obviously, we're just wanting to get back to the room. Yeah, we're kind of wanting to get the kind of the then most we of to everything. Go back to Oktoberfest, so we do like yeah. two hours. Yeah, almost two hours. Oh, changing rooms. <laughs> changing, changing rooms were, were, were great. They were big. Uh, lockers, 20p. And they're um, really big lockers. Yeah, really big like, lockers. Huge. We could almost have got the pram in, but we didn't need to because there's loads of pram storage. Yeah, but yeah. Really enjoy it, but now we're going to go to uh, CBB's hotel and check in. One of the things I just want to quickly say is the faci facilities here at Island Towers are excellent. So there's three hotels. You've got Splash Landings where we just were, where the water park is. And there's also a restaurant called Flambo Jambos, which I think we're having dinner there or maybe breakfast in the morning. There's also the Elton Towers Hotel, which is this one here. There's And there's the CBB's hotel, which is where we'll go into, you'll see in a second. There's also got these uh, fun tree houses these fun lodges and these fun sky um like uh sky cabin things um they look really really cool and they do like a big christmas thing which you're looking back on it's actually only 20 pounds a ticket so you might have a look at that but facilities wise you've got like three hotels three different styles of outdoor lodges i think three restaurants we really wanted to get in at the roller coaster restaurant but it was uh, because it's actually in the park it was already completely sold out but your food comes out on a, on like you know a bit like in um like like yo sushi where it comes down on like the little conveyor belt well this conveyor belt is designed to be like a roller coaster and it kind of goes up and does a loop it's like your food does a loop the loop i mean as long as you haven't ordered soup but you might get if you ordered a burger or a pizza it might be upside down <laughs> Wonderful. What's the name of the book? Because <laughs> you little lady. Well, in which case, it's a good thing it's got you because I've got a present for you. You stay right here. Wow. Thank you, Bob. Now, we have for you, little lady, one of these shiny little slap Have you ever seen these things before? Oh, that's exciting. Do you know how they work? Do you know how it works? Shall I show you? Yeah, watch that. That's Ready? Put your arm out. Here, wait for it. Dad's going to do magic. <laughs> Boom! Look at that! Dad's a professional right there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, you can gather the picture of that way you won't miss anyone. Yeah, no, that's great. Thank you. No. Hello. 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 Who is it? Do you want to tap the key on to let it in on the back bit? Tap it on here. That's it, and then do the door. So this is Mr. Tumble's room. Wow. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's bunk beds here. And a TV. And a TV here. That's where Mr. Tumble puts his bag and his waistcoat at the end of the day. <laughs> Wow. That's the most psychedelic bathroom I've ever seen. Is it? There's a bathroom. Is it really? Where's, Where's the lights? Oh, look, all the light switches are all Daddy. child height. Oh my goodness. Yeah, this is not a bedroom you'd want to wake up drunk in. Oh, and it's got a sink. Why don't you give us a tour, Pops? Tell us what we've got. We've got a room. And I've got a bed look. But I can't climb up, Daddy. No, not with your shoes on, darling.
you got your band, beer, fries, onion rings, potato, churros and coffee, hog roast, pan house, maybe that's pizza, don't even know what, oh, brockwurst, pretzels, uh, sweets, and then you've got your marshmallows over there, and then souvenirs. That gives desperate for a diet coke. What, does, which one's diet coke? Maybe it's in the beer one, who knows. They've got a beer keller. I feel like a beer keller, not a beer keller, it's basically it's beer tent. Maybe that's what it literally translates to. Who knows? Right, this is probably the one for me. So we're going to the restaurant, Flambo Jambos, and we've just been Googling it. And <laughs> we've looked on TripAdvisor like three pages and there's one good review and the one good review says it's not awful <laughs> but the rest of it say that it is the worst experience they've ever had in their lives but it's the only place where you can eat yeah everywhere else is um it's kind of like closed basically yeah you can't well. just rock up <laughs> so it's the only place that we can possibly go oh you're right darling bob's just had a little sleep because she was absolutely knackered but yeah it's the only place that we can go but kind of, uh, yeah, kind of intrigued because it cannot be as bad as the review state. Oktoberfest is what we've just done. Scarefest, fireworks and Christmas. That's what we were looking at this afternoon. And it's only 20 pounds per person. So you might do that. We were looking to look at the Santa sleepover. I think it was 85 pounds a person. So we'll have a look at that as well. So we're here now what could possibly be the worst <coughs> eating experience of our lives. It should be so interesting to see what it's actually like. It cannot be as bad as those reviews anyway. I mean, I'm literally expecting my... Gr just grow. she's on your plate. I mean, that would be pretty. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, it's a lot more peaceful than it was earlier. second plate. I haven't been that ambitious. Kim's basically just having a roast dinner. Yeah. I'm struggling to make up the plate, I must admit. I'm like, what are they And then I worked out it's still carving. Like, yeah. yeah. Probably doesn't want to get out of her pram, so she's eating there. Yeah. But yeah, to be honest, good. Right, we just, we've got a free cup with poppy, I think. And we just keep refilling it with coke, so we haven't paid anything for the drinks. But yeah, it's all right. It's certainly not the horrifying experience I was expecting to be. Yeah, it's alright. There's some good choices. Some good like Caribbean food. So yeah. So, not that I've had it on this plate, but I had it on the last plate. But yeah, it's been good. It's been alright. And I'm sitting right next to the water ride. That went on earlier. Oh yeah, that's That one, that was a good one, that one. But yeah, it's been alright. So now I've finished the main, we've moved on to dessert. Actually, we've got a chocolate donut. Oh, focus. Anytime. Yep. Chocolate donut, cakes. Bobby's got a chocolate donut. Show the camera the donut. Is it yummy? Actually, the donuts are really good. And they've got a like a little truck of like ice creams. And they've got like magnums and twisters and like the actual proper ice creams. Really good. So all in all, I might leave a good review just to balance it out. Oh no, you're gonna win, are you? Oh, Dad is catching up on you. Oh, Poppy won. She has to race everywhere now. Oh, it's probably going to win. Daddy's going to catch up. Oh, oh Poppy won. I won. Who's going to win? Is it going to be Poppy? Oh, Daddy's going to win. Daddy's going to win. Oh, no. Poppy's won again. I feel so sick. I've eaten so much. I won't. I'll stop the camera here. Won't pan the camera down to our belly because it's sticking out. Oh, I've eaten so much. Well, at three times, twice, and then another two times for dessert. Ah, oh, I feel so sick. But yeah, it's all good. It's all good. Yes, yeah, so we're going back to CBB's hotel. So they have um, <clears throat> every evening they have, well, throughout the day actually, from three o'clock, they have like a program of live entertainment. So you can meet your like sort of your post and patch, your bings, or that sort of stuff. Night garden, um, and then they have. Bing doing a little sleepover thing at seven and then eight they're having a disco with Ubercorn from the Go Jetters. So I think that'd be good. 
Now, pops. Two. Breakfast. breakfast. Yeah, I like the floor in here. Look, they're having a campfire. They're having a campfire. Oh, look. Happy singer. La 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 la. Happy singer. Was it the real Bing? Yeah. Oh my goodness! So what did he do? He peeled. He looked like he All right. And what happened then? We, we found him. Well, where was he? In his bag. Oh my goodness. In his sleeping bag. Oh no. Yeah, go on then, Pops. This way. This way. Pops. So we're back at Olden Towers now. One of the things I want to mention, so this is the express parking that you get as part of the um, CBeebies Hotel. So you could come here um, without staying, but it's 18 pounds, but 18 pounds a day. So but it's literally just like a private car park. And this is the monorail and you are literally at the front gate. Here we go, CBeebies land, ding, ding, round two. Where are we going? To see Baby's Land! Yeah, here we go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Do you think we've done a good job of looking after them for Mr. Blue? Oh, thank you. They've got tummies. Oh, yes, to stop them from crying. And then they've got their little nappies on so they don't soil. Oh, how funny. Hey, I'm here all day. Together, shall we? Are you ready? Off the tree. One, nope. two, three. She's a bit too busy, Mummy. She's too busy. Hi. What are we doing now, Pops? We're waiting to see. Oh, that's going to be fun, isn't it? Ready? One, two. Right. 
minus like the scaffolding there where they're fixing it or it's the sun. Um, the old house, old house is such a beautiful place and what I like about it and what we said when we came a while before is that it's nice because it's there's kind of like sections of theme park and it's like rah, 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 rah. and then the walks between them yeah. are nice tranquil walks with yeah. nice scenery it's very picturesque yeah. and it feels a bit more like so you kids and you're in that area where it's just like music 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 screams and rides and stuff it's just nice to have a bit of a breather from it yeah it's a really nice area for that. Yeah, yeah. whereas like Thorpe Park and Drayton Manor are just like intense yeah. honest drinking yeah. drinks if you want just intense assault on the senses type stuff. So one of the things I've not done, because it's only been here since we've had Poppy, but is the Owen Towers Dungeon, which says it's about 45 minutes, so it's not like a quick one, but my God, if you've done any of the dungeons, the London one's really good, it's actually quite uh, informative, but the, the Warwick Castle one, oh my God, can I say shit your pants on YouTube? I guess I probably can. And basically nearly shut my pants. Oh my god, it was so scary. But here we go, the Gangster Granny ride. Got the uh, Gangster Granny, there's a couple of bits, and then there's Raj's shop. It's very well themed. Carousel. Let's go on the carousel, what with me? Did the gangster granny ride? I mean, it was quite intense. It was quite intense. Wasn't it, um, it was quite dark, quite loud, and quite noisy. Um, yeah. Yeah, quite considering how like softly, softly the field is green, it is like the little ones. What about like, like cannons going on? Yeah, it's quite and dark. Kind of dark and foggy. And, like, yeah. I mean, it was good. It was very good. Yeah. <laughs> Dubious as hell, this is going to go because now off we go. And remember, no bumping. This is your driving. Oh, she's off. Don't drive like your mum and dad here. This is serious. Oh, we're going to have a head on car crash. Was that good though, pups? The man helped. Yeah, the man did help you, yeah. Only available where? When it's raining. I like that one. Last year's Christmas tree for sale. Needles not included. Contact Emma Bauble. Very funny. Very funny. Watch how fast it goes. Oh, I just can't, I don't understand it. Snow? We just, I've just snuck away, I've gone on 13, which I was here actually the weekend that it opened. Um, and it's definitely it's a really good roller coaster. And that's, that's one of the ones. I made friends in the queue to receive lad. And um, 13 is definitely one of the ones that I'd want to come on if I was here. Um, that uh, Nemesis when I was there was good. Oblivion, don't be able to get a chance to go on. The queue was too long. And a uh, Wicker Man, Wicker Man's awesome. Uh, Rita is great, but the queue is, the queue is so long that it's actually out the queue line now, which I've never seen before. But uh, yeah, Copson. 
here we've just had some chips, haven't you? Yeah. They were yummy. And uh, now we're going to find the toilet and maybe find some lunch. Let's see what else we can find. It's a testament to how much Kim's enjoyed it. She's just been going, oh, I want to stay again, I want to come again for a third day. I think three days in Old Towers might be a bit much. But two days has just been perfect. It's been just enough time to actually kind of enjoy it and there'd be enough time to spend at CBeebies Land, but also not be too stressed about kind of rushing around. It's been lovely. It's now half one on, uh, on day two, so on the Wednesday. We just had a good time. And uh, we're now going to go and have a look at the Sea Life Centre. You having fun? Yeah. I've just been saying you want to come back for another day. Yeah, I want to stay in. Look at him. Look at that. Sounds tasty. Fire goby and regal tang. Oh, look at the shark. There it is, a little tunnel. Just went on the Wicker Man, and I know it's one of the newest roller coasters here, but it's so good and it's really underrated. Fully wooden roller coaster, it is immense. It's like it's basically like it's like an assault on the senses. It's just so so fast, and um, yeah, you just feel every bump. And oh man, it's so good. Pretty much no queue either. I actually stood here like 11 for the last couple of minutes because I'm not sure when the steam comes out, fire breathe, breathe fire out. So um, yeah, just kind of hoping that happen in the background of this. That'd be a good timing, but I'll That's it. That's it. That's it. Let's go. Go then. Statue still. Oh, you wobbled, you lose. <laughs> Do 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 of course you can have a photo taken with me. Here's Captain Barnacle from the Octonauts. Oh, 
in the night. Who are we going to see, Pops? Out the other side. Oh, what is this? This is the, the Binky Nock. Right. Eagle, eagle, eagle on. And here's the Tomney Booze. Here is a house. Who's their pants? Who's here? I go around. It's the Harpoos. The Harpoos. That blended in with your side. Oh, look, it's the Macapaca. It's Macapaca's cave. Hello, Upsy Daisy. Ipsy, Upsy Daisy, do. It's Eagle Piggle. Yes, my name is Eagle Piggle. If you stand back a little bit. You got both be on your head. So we are now at the end of CBeebies Land and the end of our two days here. We have had so much fun. Um, it's just been brilliant. We've been here for two days. Oh, we're getting in the pram, are we? Yeah. We've been here for two days. Uh, stayed over at the CBeebies Hotel and we've just had awesome, awesome time. Poppy has loved it, she's knackered. Um, we, it's, uh, it's 10 to 4, we've got a two hour drive ahead of us, we'll stop for some in to eat. But yeah, it's been great, hasn't it? Yeah, I wanted to tell you it's a three day one. Yeah, and I guarantee the three day would have turned into four days. <laughs> but it's just been great fun. It's, it, I'm so glad because we came here um, September 2019, the same dates, two years ago. And we just loved it so much. And I was worried that we would come back and not enjoy it as much. But we've enjoyed it probably more this time. Okay, um, she's got more out of it. And we yeah. stayed. Oh, it's been brilliant, so I'd so totally recommend someone staying. Um, but when you look at the tickets, you don't have to book, you can book the hotel separately um, to your tickets and use the Sun Savers, it's unbelievable. So the Sun Saver window for Alton Towers was open in uh, beginning of April this year, and it might be the same next year, but definitely keep an eye out on the Sun's website um, and on their social channels. But it's so much cheaper, well, it's so much cheaper, it was free. For the tickets and the hotel was two fifty. Really. Yeah, by the time you bought the coffee for the sun. But we've had such a good time. Um, and just want to say thank you to anyone watching. Um, please like and subscribe, and uh, it really helps out the channel. And uh, yeah, just want to say thank you for watching. Bye.